It's just as we expected. Not a soul in sight. What could possibly have happened here? Baltro! I should have known this was your doing. Why such hostility? I've merely prepared the warmest of welcomes for my honored guests. The locals are just dying to greet you with nothing but the finest hospitality. Well, their awakened corpses are. Monster! <laughs> Stay on your guard, Yunisa. Ah, if it isn't El Tolindra, I see they've lifted the spell. What ill fortune for you. Newly restored, only to serve as the main course in a banquet of flesh and blood. Gerard. Are you sure this is wise, Your Majesty? Most kings wouldn't vacate their palace in search of mere sightseeing. The minister will manage more than fine in my absence. He always does. It must be nice having such a capable aide in your service. Nice? The man amends every word of every document I write. What good is my lifting the pen at all? Ah. <sighs> Not to mention, he governs the royal appeals. If the egoist wants to be king so bad, I say let him. And despite my father's retirement, he's still very much alive and exerting his influence. Making me little more than a crowned ornament in someone else's court. One who spends most of his time being scolded by those who hold the reins. In any case, Travel is where my heart truly lies. I want to see this land for myself, her people, her towns. And I want to do so with my own eyes, not through faded paintings and narrow castle windows. Only then will I know how best to rule as king. Hmm. And that's why you've absconded without so much as a word of where you're going. The minister will be furious, you know. Just imagine the lecture that awaits your return. Ah, but that's where you come in, my darling. I'll simply claim you whisked me halfway around the world in one of your devilish antics. <laughs> you wouldn't dare. <laughs> You're late. So, what now? That accursed ring has undone the magic we worked so hard to realize. A trivial setback, seeing as the sanctuary lies in ruins. You say that now, but I'm the one who cleared your path into Elheim. Surely you haven't forgotten what I demanded in return? You asked for a spell, and you were given it. Huh. And I'm saying it's lost its value to me. Mm, only for a moment. The rebels die here, and with them, the ring's influence. Just see to it that the seer survives the slaughter. I've need of her. Alive. Onerous wench. A shame these cadavers only bear so much self-restraint.
Good choice. They won't escape. Moving out. I'll take wing. I hope I can help. I'm on my way. We'll never lose. At least try. you back. I mustn't grow complacent. Ignorant fool. Just tell me what to do. Loud and clear. What would you have me do? I'll handle this. Out of my way. I wonder what we can do with this. What would you have me do? I'm on my way! We'll never lose. That's what you get. dead like they were his damn puppets. Either way, I'm cutting the strings. This will help. Out of my way. They won't escape. They're tough. Huh. 
<laughs> this is nothing. I'll handle this. Understood. How shall I proceed? Onward. Good. No choice but to fight. Can't do much. Stay now and I'll just drag you down. here. ever closer. You face me. A fine bout. I can still fight. I'm on my way. We march. The path is set. To me. Come then. Getting stronger by the day. How shall I proceed? The path is set. This might be a struggle. to my former strength. Victory grows ever closer. Tis merely a bit of pain. Another step up. I shall see it done. I advance. My griffin will get a treat for this. I wield it by your royal word. I shall see it done. I advance. Until my, by your rule, what would you ask of me next? Just leave it to Lex. Both of us are quite pleased. In service of the crown. I stake my honor on this battle. This lance for the people of Cornea. 
I see you don't value your life. I'm even better than Clive now. My Griffin will get a treat for this. For the people of Beverith. Know your standing. Until my dying breath, your decree made manifest. I stake my honor on this battle. I seize this victory as my own. I shall see it done. Until my dying breath. I advance. I can still fight. I have reached my... I shall see it done. Your decree... Until my dying... I advance. What would you ask of me next? I will... Your decree... <laughs> I have reached my destination. Perfect sync. Time is at hand. <laughs> Until my dying breath. In His Highness's honor. We march. To me. It's my duty as a priest. How can I help? I'll do it. Good. The time is at hand. The path is set. Now then. I did it! This is the place. Come then. For the people of Feverus, your villainy ends here. I must never yield. Have I always held such potential? A fine bout. I'm far from helpless. Right. Come then. Let me. I see you don't value your. I'm ready for anything. The crown grows lighter with each passing day. I'll do it. What would you ask of me next? What next? Your villainy and. Let me take this one. Let's see just how strong I- I can't fail my sacred mission. I could use some assistance. We march. This might be a struggle. <laughs> How can I help? I wield this lance for the people of Cornea. I could use some assistance. I can win this. Don't stop now. I can still fight. To the sky! This might be a struggle.
How shall I proceed? I stake my honor on this battle. I could use some assistance. Understood. Now then. I'm here. This is the place. I hope I can help. I shall see it done. I advance. We march. Onward. You'll never win. Until my dying breath. By your royal word, there is time yet to claim victory. I see you don't value your life. Everything in service of my people. On my honor as a knight. What would you have me do? For the people of Fevrith. My lance grows ever sharper. I'm far from helpless. I'll do it. Your villainy ends here. Don't even think about messing with me! We march. I shall see it done. Your decree made manifest. Tis a deficient plan. Until my dying breath, by your royal word. This should be quick. I stake my honor on this battle. I shall see it done. Your decree made manifest. You'll never win! I did it! I'll do what I can. Right. I'll handle this. I wield this lance for the people of court. I advance. For the people of Fevrith! I require a brief respite. I hope I can help. Understood. I stake my honor on this battle. My steed can ride no further. I did it! It's ours now. 
You face me. Victory grows ever closer. A minor inconvenience. <clears throat> to me. Take notes, Lex. Any odds by your royal word. What would you How ask of me next? Let me take this one. We march. A minor inconvenience. I advance. I'm ready for anything. I see you don't value your life. I blossom ever brighter. I seize this victory as my own. I shall see it by your royal word. I can win this. Fly through the banner of the Liberation. I'll handle this. What would you have me do? Your villainy ends here. It shouldn't come as a surprise. Well fought. Nothing less! Now then. See, Chloe? I'll I handle do this. Stuff. I'm on my way. I'm far from helpless. I'll do it. I wield this lance for the people of Cornea. I take arms. Your orders, my liege. Forward. Until my dying breath, your decree made manifest. I have reached my destination. I shall be your shield. And how shall I proceed? Forward! This, this is, is the place. place! A pitiful end awaits! Wait till I tell Liza about this! I fear this is but received. Understood! I stake my- You face me! I see you. Come then! Victory grows ever closer. Your villainy ends here. Getting stronger by the day. I'm on my way. Tis a grim day. How can I help? My thanks. Your orders, my liege. What would you ask of me next? Time is at hand. I'll the try fruits my of this kindness shall come to bear. I shall be your shield. Time is no friend to us now. The path is set. 
Come then. My griffin's nervous. <laughs> Stronger than ever, we march. Onward. You face me. Ah, such cruelty. Hasn't anyone taught you to respect your elders? Still, it won't be me you face here. But the pitiful remains of these foreign elves. Mark my words, Baltro. I'll not tolerate this desecration any further. <sighs> Are you truly so different from them, recent prince of the long-dead Cornia? Worry not, boy. You'll be counted among their ranks soon enough. Does the sanctity of life mean nothing to you? Forward! You can do it! your mind. A little ice for you. Cheer up. Thunder. See, you've made quick work of your beloved brethren. Have you no heart? No shame for the atrocities you commit? Prepare to face judgment for your ghastly crimes. <clears throat> what? <clears throat> this has all been quite lovely. But I fear I have no more time for futile games. I shall finally rid myself of that irksome ring and the girl both. I can't let you do that. How dare you! These two may be mere obstructions on your path of conquest, but I've need of them both, and none of you. Seems the ghoul slipped away. Why have you helped us? Because that girl is the only vessel I have, and I've no interest in seeing it defiled. What do you mean, vessel? Simple. Zenoira's spell is not the mind control you think it is. No, it is a channeling magic, designed to place a fallen soul into the body of one who yet lives. You mean to say all those we thought were puppets were actually possessed by spirits of the dead? Which implies you're one of them yourself! Mind your manners, child. Living souls are just as easily transferred as the deceased, and mine is very much still alive. 
for the moment, perhaps. We'll just have to see about that, won't we? Now, I know you seek the ancient texts housed within the Tower of Thorns. Meet me at its peak, and we can finally bring this long-winded chapter to a close. <laughs>